All right, we're, we're we are recording. For a second, I thought you were gonna say we are live. We'll put on the volume on this. Well, in a way, we are live. Are we? A little bit. Are we alive? Activision presents. We're good enough. A smashing blast oh, I never blast. noticed that they actually say that. Yeah. I think in the update now you're able to skip this intro. I'm not going to. They like updated this game. Yeah. I love this. Yeah. So this is Sam playing right now. This is me suffering. Out of the two of us. This is me suffering for your sins. I am Josh. I'm. And I am not playing this game. And I'm. I'm, I'm scared. Nice it to meet is you. because I. I don't like Crash 1. I love Crash 1. I mean, it's my least favorite of the trilogy, but... Uh, should I just start a new game? Or... Yeah, new game. I'm not gonna save auto save. I wanna just don't overwrite my old save. <laughs> Welcome to a brand new world. Oh, a new world. A whole new. Oh, I'm not gonna sing that. We can't sing that. We can't sing that. We We're not allowed. Don't anger our Disney overlords. This bandicoot will be my general. He will lead my cortex commandos to world domination. This time, I shall. So why is it a fork? I thought that was a skewer thing, like what you stab steaks with. Well, you know what. Better question, where's your girlfriend? Did they take her out? She is... No, no, she's still in this. She's not in any of the sequels, but she's in this. Yeah, what the hell happened there? I don't know. I never understood why this didn't work for Crash either. What I don't understand is... Why Crash died in the first place? Prepare the female bandicoot. See, they just capture it, but they don't actually do anything with her. I mean, like, are they experimenting on innocent animals? I, I yes, that's what we just saw. Do, 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 oh, it's do, do. time for the guy who challenged Mario and lost. I'm not talking about Sonic. I'm well, fine. I mean, he tried. Okay, let's make one thing very clear right now. This is not a hundred percent playthrough. Oh, I wonder why. I love this game. Not when you one hundred percent it. Does that go for all the games? I uh... see. I don't mind one hundred percenting three. Definitely don't love it. Well. You love three, isn't it your favorite? Three is two is fantastic. Two is great. Three is my favorite. I know there's a lot of people like two over three, and that's perfectly like that makes sense. Do you could? I like three more just because I like it a lot better. And you I mean love the the one where you go driving. Okay, minus the driving level. But be three has a lot of those levels when you're looking against the camera, and it drives up a wall. I love the song. Oh, I just killed myself. Oh, do you remember the original name for this game? Sonic's Ass Game. Yep. It's amazing. I have to say, I'm okay. I'm instinctively clicking R1 right now because I keep I keep trying to slide, mm -hmm. and I've got crashes and slide in this game. All right. He's kind of static. What's really weird though is that it. Okay, so they added time trials to Crash 1. Yeah. And they didn't... This game was not designed for that. Like, not at all. Uh, if I want to get the box gym, I have to go back, but I don't want to get the box gym. So, suck it. Um, in Crash 2, they give you the Crash Dash. And you didn't have the Crash Dash in the original Crash 2. So I don't know why they didn't give it for this game. I'm like, to be fair, you only unlocked it after you beat the game, but... 
What is this? Oh. No. Stormy, don't do it. We're not doing it. It's not happening. Poor bastard. I think I beat it on my regular file, actually. Uh, you did? I think so. Well, too bad we will never know. Maybe. It's not. I'm... I might show it off later, but... So are you excited for Crash Team Racing? I am losing my shit for Crash Team Racing. I absolutely... Yeah, but won't there be DLC for that game? I'm fine with that. As long as they, uh... As long as the base game is just the original Crash Team Racing. Oh, could you imagine if they... Not if they, like, skim stuff out? Yeah, and then put it back in for DLC. That would be... I hope they still have. Up. I hope they still have cheat codes also, because I don't like playing Crash Team Racing's Adventure Mode. It's kind of annoying. It's not bad. It's just actually, yeah, it's kind of bad. <laughs> uh, how do I do this without dying? There we go. You could go back and smash the metal one though. With bomb. And the bombs will explode it. Yeah, but they won't. The bombs will. In the original game, they won. If you off-screened any uh, TNT near the bomb, huh? the bomb would go off, but none of the uh, none of the other crates would in the original. How do you fill yourself, your your head with this information? Ooh, too much YouTube watching. One, I two, see. three, four, five. In the original game, I believe it was three for the jumps. Also, in the original PS1 release. Doing these bonus st stations was the only way you could save. And it was bullshit. Didn't you have a password system in the original? Yeah, you did have a password system. But, that was the only way you could save original. Oh. Hello, darkness, my friend. And I'm crashing like, Ooh. Oh, you should see what happens if you miss a large number of boxes. What happens? It knocks Crash to the floor. <laughs> You get a trophy for it, actually. It's great. The Great Gate. I love the boss battles in this game, too. I think they're okay. There's one boss battle that pisses me off, but I... Ooh. Uh, Ripper Roo. Oh my god, yeah, fuck that guy. Ripper Roo pisses me off, and... Well, he's like a blue Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo and crack. <laughs> Almo almost literally. Crash looks weird having the max mask like that in that angle. This gives us the kill. Uh, unless you have the uh, mask, right? Uh, this... okay, I suck at these going up levels. No, this is just gonna take some time. Oh, just wait till we get the Sunset Vista. <laughs> I hate Sunset Vista. Ah. Oh thing. Nope. I will not. I am not. I'm not ready to die! Ooh, I almost- Oh, I hate these fuckers also. Oh, they're annoying. Well, 13 mm. lives, not bad. They're all gonna go away. <laughs> we're gonna lose them so oh, we're in the quick. first game, right? We're gonna lose them so quick. Yeah, we're the, the uh, fourth Dark Souls game. Oh, are we bringing that up? So, yeah, I didn't realize this Bre and Breath of the Wild were actually part of the Dark Souls series. Breath of the Wild? Yeah. Since when? Since... Uh, I don't know. Since I've never heard about that in my life. I didn't find Breath of the Wild that hard. It, it wasn't. It, 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 it was very hard. It was very easy to break, actually. In the beginning, it's a little hard. Yeah, but as soon as you beat one Divine Beast, you're good. Mephos Grace? Yeah! Boom, boom. Give me those lives. By the way, you can infinitely retry these. Those. You, you lose, you just hop right back in, it's no problem. Oh wow, I didn't know that. Alright, hello darkness, my old friend. Wait, we're not doing that gonna run. Bop, 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 Boulders. Oh, you gotta love them. Indiana Jones boulders. This is our first looking back. 
right? Yeah. This is a level in Uncharted 4. Remember that? Hmm. Yes. I remember when you got to play Crash and Hard 4 and everyone was like, holy shit! You got to play Crash twice. Yes! And it was rigged because you couldn't beat her score no matter what you did until the end of the game. Because at the end of the game they had an extra life box. Oh, I feel a metaphor. Yeah, in Uncharted 4 probably. I love Crash's face during this. Ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> Well, a giant boulder's coming after him, the poor guy. Lost his girlfriend. Just like... He, he's having one bad day. Well, the first part of this game is no issue. It's when we start getting the second part where things get a little crazy. You mean jungle? Deep, deep down jungle? This is the levels get long. They do get kind of long. Oh, you did it! I did it! Look at that smile. Oh, that's lovely. So happy. <laughs> so can he talk? Uh, Crash has never talked as far as I'm aware. He speaks in the ancient language of... But... So he speaks in the ancient language of dumbass. Yes. I speak that language. Don't we all? Uh. Eh. Some people don't. Boop. 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 Bop. Nice. That perception. Foreshadowing. And so it begins. This is only the beginning. Cool. Yes, yeah, so, uh, sixty-nine. You have no idea what he has planned. Well, what the game has planned for you. I played this game three times. And then you have issues. It's oh, I like this game. It's, it's just sometimes I try to speed run, and this game is not designed for that. You try to speedrun it? Like you'll see, sometimes I get ahead of myself and I just hold up and hope to god that everything goes right. Why would you do that? Because I'm a maniac. Yes. You are a maniac playing Crash. Mm -hmm. It's not that hard. Oh, those ones go whenever- I love how you say that. And then the game's like, no, fuck you. Oh. So do you play this with the D-pad or the analog stick? Analog. You? It's analog. But not a lot of people who play with the D-pad. I guess that's because that's what they're used to. And the game was designed with it in mind. Yeah. But I need that precision. Boom boom. Loading. Oh! Ah. That was close. That was close. That was close. Oh, come on. Woo! Three boxes, really? <sighs> Bless you. We're gonna sneeze. Thank you. <sighs> papu papu. First boss of the game. We'll call it a part after this, I guess. Seems like a good place. Yeah. Come here. Bop. Very easy boss. Yeah, that's the first boss, so. Yeah, that's it. That's that's Bopu Bopu. So that's an ass. What a dick! <laughs> I guess it really was the first 3D game of its time, so it really had to bring people into it like that. 
I'm pretty sure this came out before 64, right? Uh, I don't know. Oh, before we go. Oh, yeah. We'll get to that next time. Da -da -da.